By 1950, all that remained of the once extensive system operated in the north and northwest of County Donegal by the London Derry and Luxville Railway, by the branches from Derry to Letterkenny and Bancrana. The line beyond Letterkenny to Burtonport, which we covered in Volume 3 of this series, and that from Bancrana to Carndana, had already closed by this time. This is Pennyburn and Derry, where the company had its works. 460 tank number three, built by Andrew Barclay in 1903 for the opening of the Burtonport line, is seen on shed. At Fawn, on the shores of Luxville, north of Derry, we are awaiting the arrival of the goods from Derry to Brincrana, which conveyed a carriage at the rear for any passengers who were not in too much of a hurry to reach their destination. And here she comes, hauled by 462 tank number 10, built by Kerr Stewart in 1904 and originally named Richmond. The third wagon in the train is a CDR one. Despite operating in the same county, Luxville and Donegal wagons had draw gear of different heights and only a few specially modified CDR wagons could be conveyed in Luxville trains. The line from Londonderry to Brincrana was built as a broad gauge route opening in 1864. It was converted to the three foot gauge in 1885 and extended with government money some 18 and a half miles north to Carndana in 1901. The extension lasted only 34 years, closing in 1935. Freight traffic on the branches to Letterkenny and Brincrana ceased in July 1953, three years after these scenes were recorded. However, the company continued to operate buses and lorries long after its rail services had ended, these vehicles proudly proclaiming that they were the property of the Londonderry and Luxville Railway Company. <laughs> 